Hello, <clears throat> welcome to my channel. Just a quick video about the Ligo T Echo which arrived yesterday and it works. There's a dummy load on it at the moment. You'll see why because I'm going to test the antenna. It comes in a nice box. This is the 868 megahertz version that I ordered and it works at 868 so it probably is. And what I thought I'd do is I'd quickly test the antenna. So let's have a look at the antenna which is this thing. It's very nice. It's quite fat and this um, skirt around the bottom goes over this lip on the plastic top to make it a little bit waterproof which I like. So there's the antenna that came with the device and this is my Nano VNA and let's look at the VSWR curve and um, oh dear <laughs> this is one per division so the SWR is like one two three at best at a lower frequency than 868. The marker is at 870 megahertz. This is not ideal. Um, not ideal at all. So I thought about it and I thought well antennas sometimes need ground planes so if I just hold on to this what happens and then oh you can see now the SWR has gone right down to one to one at just above 870 megahertz which is what I would hope. The only problem is when you let go of it <laughs> it um, <clears throat> is a bit variable performance. Seems to need some kind of grounding and of course this plastic Lilygo device is not going to provide much of a ground plane so I wonder if anybody else has noticed this or tested the antenna with their Lilygo. When I tested it yesterday it seemed to be better at 915 megahertz so uh, let's see what's going on. Thanks for watching and remember to like and subscribe.